Hello everyone, Wise Gamer here, and I decided to make that martial arts PC game. It's gonna cost me thirty-five thousand dollars before this. Oh my god, I'm gonna put myself so much in the red. This game better work. Uh, martial arts action. I don't think the story and quest is gonna be that good, but the engine and gameplay is gonna be important. So let's do that. Uh, this game just needs to come out early. I'm gonna be so screwed if this goes to fifty thousand in the red. Um, really bad. Dialogues. <laughs> it's martial arts. That kind of makes me think of like. Yeah, whatever. We'll, we'll raise the action up some. I think that's better for us. God, this game needs to just go. So, uh, last episode, guys, sorry. I, I should have said um, an introduction here and everything. So, hi everyone, Wise Gamer here. And today we're playing another indie game play. Um, I'm picking up exactly where I picked up last time. I just didn't stop the game. I just recorded again. Uh, I'm super in the red right now. Uh, I have 141 fans. $37,000 in debt. I made my own game engine and I took a risk and I'm hoping it's going to work out. So we got better graphics, we got better sound. Um, I'm going to raise the graphics up there a little bit and lower the world design just a tad and hope to God that this works out. Uh, this game needs to be good and it needs to sell well and I if next tick I am done. So this, this needs to go. We need to get these bugs out. Oh God. The Master V came out, which is the Master System. Got it. Okay, finish. Send it, send it, send it, send it. Start selling. <clears throat> oh god. And your company's about to go bankrupt. We've decided to give you a deal. We'll offer you $70,000, which should be more than enough to get... But you have to commit to pay us $135,000 in a year's time. I guess I have to. Oh my god. <laughs> this sucks. I gotta bail out. But I don't want to die or lose. Uh, I might lose already on... 2D Graphics V1 Level 1 because it's a new engine, but that's cool. Release the game. Hopefully this is good. We'll see what the reviews say. First reviews came in. Let's see what these said. So all fives? Oh my god, all fives and a four. That's my first freaking engine, guys. Come on. Give me a break. Oh, God. Let's see if there's any contract work. I need money because I need to pay back the bank $135,000. I'm so screwed. I'm so screwed, guys. Uh, my company's going to go under. I don't know what happens if you go bankrupt. I think the game's just over. Let's see. The Master V has been released. Um, yeah, that sucks. Okay, I got this contract that it looks like, so we're good there. Cool. That was easy. Are we getting 14 fans? That's not bad, right? We doubled what we needed, or we, I mean, we, yeah, $8,000 loss, but we gained $8,000 after the, uh, the net, so, that's cool. We don't need to create a new custom engine, but we'll make another, um, contract deal. We'll try this one out. This is a lot of money. It's $21,000, so it'd be really nice to, to get this one. As long as he doesn't get itchy, I think we'll be okay. That's the problem, is the guy, you know, scratches his head, and... You know, Thomas over here. Oh, oh, he was getting ready to scratch his head, I think. Just what we wanted, $21,000. Thank you. Okay, can I pay back the bank now? Oh, my God. I have to pay them back in a year's time, so let's just, like, boost up our stuff as much as possible, I guess. I don't know. We need to sell more games and, uh, and get a lot of money, and that way we'll be okay with um, paying back the bank. So, uh, engine it seems to be very important for this type of game. So, I think we did a high engine for that. So, let's develop a new game. Let's pick a new topic. Let's do something we haven't done yet. Let's do, uh, evolution I really want to do. Let's do, uh, virtual pet. Why not? For a virtual pet simulation game with my engine, and we're gonna... You know what? Like... Let's do it. Let's go for the TES, because Nintendo is always about those pet games. We're gonna go for broke again. Uh, this is gonna be bad, because we just did... Oh man, we just did that loan. I don't know how quickly a year's gonna come up, but I'm kinda scared. This is gonna cost me so much money, look at that. Oh my god, I'm already in the red. So pet simulation, let's see. I don't think that story and quest is very important, so we're gonna really lower that down. We wanna do save games and linear story. It's gonna cost me more money, but why not? Lower the engine some, gameplay is gonna be up. Let's just see what happens, guys. Game is off the market now. $105,000 in sales, so it did pretty good, which is is good to know. I mean, if we look at our game history real quick, what's like our best-selling one? 105, 114, 70, 32, 96,000. So let's do it. We should do another one of these, a space strategy game. It's been a little while. Um, 
That's probably going to be our next game. You don't want to do the same game twice in a row. Stop scratching your head. Yeah, the same game twice in a row will give you in trouble. So, um, artificial intelligence dialogue. Let's do that. Um, AI will drop a little bit. Oh boy, I'm kind of scared. Casual games is cool that we can research that, but I'm afraid that it's going to cost me more money. So I hope you guys are enjoying the series though. This is going to be, a, what, episode 3 now, so um, I might keep playing this for a little while. I mean, I'm having a lot of fun with it, but let's see. The uh, Yeah, Commodore 64 is losing market share against other PC manufacturers. I'm, I'm developing this for the TES, so I don't care right now. Uh, Commodore 64 has been unsuccessful in introducing higher priced computers to compete against the more advanced PCs. Cool, so PC is outranking them like we knew would happen eventually. Um, what's cool about this game is like they really do follow like the actual like linear what happened <laughs> with stuff. So, uh, world design, we're going to drop some. Graphics is good. Sound, we'll bring up a little bit because it is a, a pet simulation. Eh, let's, let's do that. Uh, maybe right there. I'm so scared to like have a bad game again because I'm, I'm so red right now and I'm gonna have to pay the bank back um, like this needs to be a good game so let's get these bugs out of here look at how high my design and technology is though and my research points yeah this is gonna be good so let's let this go okay we got to release it we're, we're way too red right now it's a new record there almost a new record on technology there we go leveled up our 2d graphics now getting our, our game released Oh wow, cool, the Game Boy's coming out, the Gameling. This is why I love this game, guys. I love gaming so much, and indie gaming, and this is literally me being an indie developer in a computer. Like, this, this is why this game's awesome, so. Um, let's see, first reviews came in, let's see what happens. Pet games for Nintendo, come on, guys. Holy crap, we got a freaking 8. I don't think I've gotten an 8 yet, unless it was that first game, but. 7, okay, cool. Give me some great reviews, guys, I need to make some money. 6, I hate you. I mean... Hey, I'll take it. It's better than a four. Beautiful. All right, so we'll take it. We'll take it right now. Fine contract work. Let's let's get some money in here again. Um, let's do it. Why not? I have to set up some computers. I can do it. Look at how many units I'm selling. Holy crap! Almost ten thousand in a week. Maybe. Uh, oh no. Started week two already. Ranked thirty-two. Though. That's not bad. We got more fans and everything. Eighteen thousand dollars transfer to us, real quick. Cool contract work. Uh, yeah, we can do that. That's easy. I want to make up some quick money here. I got to pay the bank back, so I'm almost at $135,000. I should be after this contract. And that game is selling well, so we're good there. Uh, what do we say? We want to make another space simulation game, right? So, ooh, 21 design in three weeks. I don't think I can do that. This one, maybe. Uh, the new game platform, Gameling by Nintendo. So, Game Boy just came out. That's cool. I'm not really going to be big on portable gaming, I don't think, with my company. I don't, I don't feel I should be. Um, yeah. Let's see. So another contract was successful. $18,000. So, yeah, we're making pretty good money now. Um, let's see what we can research real quick. Uh, casual games. Game tutorial sounds cool. Let's do that. It's going to cost us just a little bit of money, but we're making good money at the same time from that game. Uh, in three months time, why did I just do this? God damn it. <laughs> oh no. I need more money. Hurry. Research it. Get done. Okay, thank you. Okay, game engine part. To be able to use this in your games, you need to create a new engine which includes the part? Oh, come on. How to make a new engine? Screw you guys. Okay, let's, let's go for broke. I need this 23k, so... Hopefully I get this design out. If I don't do it, I don't know what happens. I guess I go bankrupt because the, the bank's going to take all my money. And I don't know if I'm going to get it done. Holy crap. Oh, no. No. Oh, my God. Damn it. I can do marketing as a research. That's cool. Contract failed. Lost $5,000. No big deal, guys. It's all right. Fine contract work. I'm screwed. Uh, I'm screwed. Develop a new game. Quickly. Oh, shit. <laughs> Let's do a space simulation game. Um, I might be done, guys. I don't know. We might have to start a whole new one. Let's do space simulation for the PC again. It's only got 16% market share. Yeah, whatever. Why not? Game engine will be my engine. Next. $35,000. God damn. Start development on this. And yeah, well, the bank's going to ask for the money and we're, we're going to be screwed. So, um, The engine was important for this one, I think. Story and quest is very... Not important. Linear story, that's cool there. Oh, man. 
This is gonna suck. Come on, just make a beast game as fast as you can. Uh, dialogues can go down some, level design and AI can go up. Design can go down quite a bit. $43,000, we need to make $100,000 in like a month, guys. It's not gonna happen. I don't know what happens to us, but we'll let the video go until this happens at least. Uh, graphics wasn't too important, I remember that. Um, world design was, though. Oh god, it looks like- oh shit. Okay, it's been deducted, so we're not bankrupt. Holy crap! Okay. We see your serious financial difficulties. We're willing to offer you a mini credit to tie you over. And so you're getting- We'll give you $185,000 to cover your costs and expect to be paid back the full amount, plus a fee of $9.3,000 one month after the game's released. Oh. <laughs> okay, do it! If you have more than $1 million in cash, you'll be able to move to the next level. This might sound like a lot, but don't worry. So... Okay, here comes a Sega uh, Game Gear, whatever, that's cool. Unlike similar devices which don't come close to the gaming consoles, it's basically the full power of the Master VX if you can take it with you. That's cool. So, will it take out the Game Boy? Um, I got my bailout, which is nice, but I need to make a crap load of money. And it said, what is it, one month after the release of the game, they're gonna start charging like 10000 per month? Oh my god. I got a new record for stuff, so that's cool. This is this is bad. I'm in I'm in trouble here. I need to start doing contracts and not spend so much money on things. I need to just make games right now, and that's that's all I can focus on really is contracts and games. Oh god, let's release the game. Let's just see what happens. Please give me some good reviews. It's got good design and technology, right? This is kind of like a sequel to our last PC game, like this, right? Right? I mean, the first one was good, and this is game number seven. Come on! Oh, oh my god! Holy crap, it's a 10, guys. It's a 10. Oh my god, another 10. This is insane. This is perfect. Holy crap, I cannot believe it. Oh my god, I got... Damn you all games. If you just gave me a 10, I cannot believe it. Holy sh shoot. Uh, I'm trying not to cuss as much. Let's get a new topic because we're running out of stuff here. Let's do let's do surgery simulation game. Let's Why not, right? Um... Oh my god, though. Look at that. Holy crap. Oh my god, it's it's number one rank. Holy crap. Oh my god, I can't believe it. I'm making... Oh my god, I got half a million dollars. Oh. Holy crap, over a hundred thousand. This is so awesome. Sorry, guys. I'm just extremely excited about this because... This hasn't happened before. You can make quite a name for yourself, you saved a lot of capital. If you want to grow your company further, move into the next office, the next step. I found the perfect place for you. Uh, pay $150,000. Would you like to come to the office to the next level? Mm, yes, let's do it. Even though we owe the big money, let's do it anyway. We're gonna go ahead and expand. Oh my gosh, this is so cool. Oh, I love this game. Look at that, we got like a little chalkboard up there and stuff. You have a bigger office, you can also hire staff and forge a world-class development team to make even better games. And also train yourself and your staff to improve skills. Let's try this by completing the management course, which is required before you can hire your first employee. So, guys, I'm going to have to wrap it up here. I will start the next episode right away from this point, um, but we're going to have to wait for it. So I hope you guys enjoyed, though. We'll see you next time. And make sure you subscribe and like if you did. Uh, subscribe for more content because I do upload every day, and almost all of my content is focused on indie gaming. So if you guys like this type of gameplay, if you like the indie studio stuff, then you're going to like my content. So I hope you enjoyed. We'll see you next time.